So our next contestant, may I please invite Mr. Tirapong, please. And his topic will be on wah, wah, what's my name? Are you ready? Yes. All I'm right, ready. then. The stage is yours. One, two, three, and four. Another four seconds that a new patient is diagnosed with Alzheimer's disease, a disease which is affecting over 40 million people worldwide. Its first symptom was described in 1901 by Dr. Alois Alzheimer, a German psychologist. Difficulty sleeping, disturbed memory, and drastic mood changes are mainly symptoms of this disease. Usually, every single time, when you are going to lift your arm up and down, your brain has to command all the way from your brain to your arm through the thing that we call it as nerve cells. Nerve cells is act like a domino parrot which is stand still and waiting for someone to hit it and it's going to pause continuously until to the end of this parade. So it can cause your nerve cells to be sent a signal and your arm will be able to move up and down. And what would happen if there is something block the signal parade? Of course, the signal won't be sent to your arm and your arm will not be able to move anymore and it won't function anymore. The case is what exactly happened to the Alzheimer patient's brain in some part. A small peptide called amyloid beta is a signal blocker. And usually, there will be the janitor cells to clean up this blocker. But when the blocker is more and more, the janitor cells have to work harder and harder until it's become hyperactivated. So it can cause your nerve cell to change its shape or bring to the cell death at the end. This is the reason why Alzheimer patients lost their short-term memory, ability to process logical thought, emotional control, and, um, yeah, the deepest memory. I believe that you guys don't want to face this situation for sure, and also me. And to prevent this thing, we have to eat well, sleep well, exercise well, and the most important thing is always learn new things. Why? Imagine this. If you have just the only pathway to remind me, which is Mark is a very handsome guy, and that pathway of nerve cells of yours is death. Of course, you will not be able to remember me anymore. But if you have more pathway to remind me, which is my real name, my first subject, my first food, you have more chance to remind me. And the chance of yours for being Alzheimer's disease gonna reduce too. Because our life is so long. Life, long learning. And always remember that you guys are more than what you can remember. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mr. Tirapong. What a very good start after the break, isn't it? Yeah. All right. Now I forgot what I was going to say. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the judges. Are you ready? Or did you forget what you're going to say as well? <laughs> okay. Andrew, please. It seemed less than three minutes. You packed a lot in. It was very clear. But how, how long was that, Bang? That was just about... Two and 30 seconds, actually. Two and okay. 30, two and 45 seconds. All right. So maybe next time, up to you to whether you want to use the extra 30 seconds you have or not. Hopefully, we'll do it next time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no pressure on the judges at all. <laughs> no pressure. Okay. Any other, other comments from the judges? Sir, like to to remember something. Is that possible to like to lead thinking and uh, thinking about or the thing that we would like to remember several times? Is that help to to to, use to reduce the the, yeah. the thing? Um, in fact, it isn't like mainly effect on what we remember, but it's effect. As I mentioned, a small peptide amyloid beta it is something like a, a protein that uh, accumulate on your nerve cells, so it is gain more and more. It's one, uh, some kind of like disturb the memory of yours. Yeah, so we have to just some kind of like uh, avoid of bad habit like smoking, sleep at uh, lately night or something like that. So the thing that we have to do is exercise well, eat well, sleep well, and that I mentioned, always learn your thing. But, uh, and you also said about the, like to create the many pathway in yeah. order to remember that. So could, could you uh, explain more about this? Um, I mean that if you would like to remember something, maybe remember something about me, and you know just that I'm a student, and if 
you forgot that thing. You won't have any chance to remind me. But if you know more thing about me, like my real name, my first subject, my uh, university, career path, or something like that, you will have more chance to remind me, like when we try to random something in the box, if we have like a red uh, ball more than a uh, yellow ball, and if we would like to catch the uh, which one that have more balls in the bowl, that gonna be more chance to remind of something that you are thinking of. Yeah. Well, you 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 were mentioning uh, eat well, sleep well, exercise well, and up, up. keep learning new things. Yes. These are preventive measure, right? How yeah. about treatment? What if a person uh, already got the disease? Treatment uh, right now, as I mentioned before, that fighting a kill is something you lose researcher today. But now the thing that researcher, uh, the sci um, scientists try to do is try to use the vaccine to reduce the accumulation rate of amyloid beta in your knob cell knob. So it's going to be some kind of like not make it easy to accumulate this amyloid beta. It's going to harder to accumulate. So the chance of yours for being Alzheimer's going to be a little bit harder than usual if you get this vaccine or the, the medicine, the pill, something like that. Yeah. Thank you. Um, and you also mentioned about the pathway. Yeah. So I was thinking of maybe the other term, maybe connection between neurons. So you, yes. you're, you're, you try to make them connected to yeah. each other. So, so there's, they will stay together, will learn things together, and yeah. hopefully you, re you will remember things after maybe a long period of time, probably. Oh, okay. okay. Well, what, what I'm saying is that well, instead of using the term pathway, you might think of the other term, probably uh, network or maybe connections oh, between cells, neurons. Okay, thank you very much. All right, any other comments? Okay, right. Okay, then, thank you very much. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much, Mr. Hyokong.